We're down to the last four then, the penultimate round in this fine competition. The two teams ahead of us here have their eyes firmly fixed on the grand prize. They both believe it is within their compass. Having come this far, they're entitled to believe that. The competition has provided us with a lot of drama up to this point, and I'm sure there is plenty more to come before it reaches its ultimate climax. You're able to enjoy with us here some great scenes at this arena by the river. There is no venue quite like this one. So it's a straight shootout for the final. That's what we're going to see. There's nowhere, Jim, you would rather be. A game, some may argue, with justification as being harder than the final itself, Peter. I can certainly attest to that from my own experience. While you do everything to tell yourself you shouldn't get too ahead of things, it's actually harder than it seems. But it's looking like a terrific occasion here. Let's just hope we have a game to match all of this. And that gets things running. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Yeah, Felipe Luis seems to give up on anything. He's been known to keep some of the world's best wingers in his pocket, but there's more to his game than defending. He times those overlapping runs to perfection and to devastating effect. Yes, he'd be my pick too. It's going to be all about how they get the best out of him. Fair to say, I think a cautious start from both teams. Has a Rafinha. It's all a little short of forward momentum, lacking thrust. Felipe, Felipe Luis with the cross. Can he deliver? on the right flank now what's next gets away from his opponents with Gabriel tries a shot and that's been leave it clear oh it's opened up nicely for has a pop there's a goal a goal and a really telling moment Time and space are plenty, he was never going to miss. Well, he made it obvious as to where the pass should be played, Peter, and it made the finish look that bit easier. I think they've gone about their business with the opener very much in mind, and this all goes well now. And here's Carrillo. Oh, he's in! Gomez! Well, he should have done better, and he knows it. Gomez certainly could have and should have made more of that. Half time in the semi final. So there you have it, a close sport half of football, but that has still had its moments, and ultimately produced just one goal. And what a decent game up to now. Well, that certainly pleased the fans and the players. Well, oh, so good. So we're already into the second period. Flamengo really need to go and, and grab... And it's Felipe. He spotted the run and played him through. And he's cut it out. Break. Gomis. 
Hoists it high. Hefty challenge, but... Gerson. And it's Gabriel. Into the channel. He's got away. Gets up to head it! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. A goal at the end of the first half. And the score is 1-0. Oh, well played. He's taken that really cleanly. All retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. That intervention was very net. Flamengo probably could have killed things off, but they should be OK here. And there goes the final whistle. Flamengo have sealed their place in the final, and their loyal support is in ecstasy. They head to the big day, genuinely expecting to win it. Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Well, they passed that test in flying colours and they're very...